with Peter Gabriel's Real World Studios in Wiltshire were the focus of global media attention last night as their record label celebrated 10 years of international music making and they even had the odd Hollywood star drop in. Well, Dave Mason joined the guests. If you happen to be strolling the leafy lanes of Box on any given day, there's a very good chance you'll bump into artists from as far away as Tibet and Senegal practicing their music and it's all down to Peter Gabriel and his team who are celebrating 10 years of real world records. It's come a long way since 1989 when Real World sold just 2,000 records. That figure now standing at over 3 million. Former Genesis frontman and founder Peter Gabriel told me that after humble beginnings, they're going from strength to strength. It's looked a little shaky like most of the things we've been involved with over the years. And now it looks uh, much more solid. I think we want to try and expand and with, with the people that we're working with, uh, you know, take direction and, and re-explore a lot of other avenues. I mean, I think we'd like to blow open the, the term world music to, to being music that is made in the world um, and that it no longer has any uh, ghetto attached. Even stars like Woody Harrelson, who attended the bash, are said to be using world music in their new movie projects. One villager explained the importance of the record label to the community. For a very small village, it's so useful to have a big employer here. Tonight I was walking the dog and a lady said, oh, I wonder if I can get in and join in. But everybody, as I say, appreciates the business here and the company here. I think it's getting recognised now as probably the, one of the most important recording studios in the world. Um, not simply because it's a great studio, but because of the amount of people it draws in uh, and the amount of amazing music it produces. Tibetan singer Yung Cheng Lamo also wowed the audience. There's no Tibetan singers up to now on the labels, any other labels. I mean, it's very, very honoured to me be on this label. As well as enjoying the party and celebrations, the founders of Real World Records are keen to point out that 10 years on, this Wiltshire studio will continue to fund and bring over artists from all over the world well into the next century. This is Dave Mason for HTV News, Fox.